because of the volcano, around 20,000 people have had to leave this area. The evacuation made even more complicated by COVID-19. And then a rumor started saying that if you wanted to get into a shelter or leave the island, you had to have a vaccine. Can you clear up whether people need to be vaccinated if they go to a shelter no, or no, if no, they're going to a ship? Because no, that's something no, no. that has no, been no, no, no. confusing and no, a lot no, of people no, have been no, talking no, no. about that no, on no, social no, no. media. No, 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 no. In relation to the issue of um, vaccination, there was absolutely no requirement at any time to go into any shelter to be vaccinated. I'm asking persons to be prepared to be vaccinated as well. Because once you leave Chateaubelair, you go to an evacuation centre, you will also be vaccinated. This is not a drill and it is not voluntary. There's a pandemic that is taking place and we'll be vaccinating persons once they enter a government-operated shelter. And I want that to be very clear to persons as well for listening this life. The cruise ships are, are indicating that to come on board that you'd be required to be vaccinated. The countries which have indicated that they would accept us, they would want us to be vaccinated before we come there. In the case of St. Lucia, suggested an option is that they could be done there. But clearly it's better if we do it all here. I Thousands ordered to leave the area, cruise ships standing by, but tonight reports authorities allowing only those vaccinated to head to those ships. Here's Gio Benitez. Tonight, the monstrous eruption on St. Vincent Island spewing ash into the sky. A pilot reported seeing the plume rising to 25,000 feet. Doors with children at the front, please. A massive evacuation underway, some 16,000 people. The ash raining down, stopping the high speed ferry rescue because of the dangerous condition. Now, tonight, four massive cruise ships are standing by offshore, waiting for orders to carry evacuees to neighboring islands. Carnival, Royal Caribbean, and Celebrity sending those ships. Local health officials making the decision to only board evacuees who have already been vaccinated against COVID. Thousands of others staying on land sent to local hotels in the safe zones as a second smaller eruption is reported tonight.